It's COVID-19 vaccination day for the residents of this asylum center in Samos. Right after the jab, they go back to their activities. The camp can accommodate up to 3,000 asylum seekers and boasts a Wi-Fi, sports center and a playground. <laughs> but with barbed wires, security gates and X-ray scanners, this camp in the northwest of Samos is located in a deserted area and is segregated from the rest of the island. The 360 asylum seekers currently living there are divided by origin in differently colored containers. The rules are harsh, an 8 p.m. curfew and agreeing to be under constant supervision. Η ασφάλεια είναι ένα βασικό ζητούμενο στους ανθρώπους αυτούς οι οποίοι έχουν φύγει από τις χώρες τους όπως οι ίδιοι δηλώνουν για λόγους ασφαλείας. Η Ελλάδα έχει γεωπολιτικά το ρόλο αυτό να βρίσκεται στα σύνορα μεταξύ Ευρώπης και Ασίας και Ανατολής, ας το πούμε έτσι. Κατά αυτό αναγκαστικά θα πρέπει να είναι αυτός ο ρόλος της. Δεν μπορεί να είναι διαφορετικά. Οφείλουμε να προασπίσουμε τα ευρωπαϊκά σύνορα. The 43 million euro camp, entirely financed by the European Union, is equipped with a unique surveillance system. The cameras are directly linked to the Migration Ministry in Athens. Alice arrived in Samos less than three weeks ago from Sierra Leone. Her perilous journey through Iran left her with deep wounds she is struggling to heal. They put me in a big house where some men come to rape me. Then one day I decided to run away from the house. I met some people with their different nationalities. I decided to follow them in the bush, walk in the night. I want to stay in Greece because I know that Greece is safe for me. The authorities are hoping to welcome the migrants surviving the Greek seas with other such camps to be inaugurated soon.